Hello, Carl here with Sustainability Theory News. We're over at the website for the University of Washington, and they're talking about small hydroelectric dams. They're talking about how they're increasing around the world without much research or regulations. There's a lot of variability in how much these dams may generate. Even some dams that have large reservoirs behind them might not produce as much electricity as a dam that has no reservoir behind it. There's, it's not really a direct science. And of course this article talks about the environmental concerns, and there certainly are those of migrating fish and whatnot. But there is also a lot of untapped potential. For instance, there's a lot of dams built in America right now for flood control and whatnot that do not have electricity uh, generation capabilities. I remember hearing a stat that only 2% of the dams in America have electrical generation, but those 2% of dams provide 10% of our electricity. And unlike solar and wind power, it's pretty much a constant flow of electricity. It's reliable, dependable. Now let's talk about some of the problems, specifically fish migration. They have gotten around that using fish ladders. And some of these dams that are for irrigation and uh, flood control, they don't have any fish ladders on them at all. So maybe they can combine a fish ladder with a makeshift hydroelectric generation system. So fish ladder is sort of like a series of small canal objects that go alongside of the dam or over top of the dam to allow fish to just swim upstream. Now of course this type of dam, which is in British Columbia, produces 45 megawatts of power and uh, the fish can simply jump right over the spillway but they can't get back up that spillway. So having a fish ladder off to the side, over the top, or maybe over this uh, spillway electrical generation spillway, which is, I'm sure this is where they house the generators, it might be beneficial. So retrofitting existing dams, dams that are already in place, rather than building more dams, might be a viable solution. What do you think? Leave your questions in the comments below, or maybe you have some ideas or concerns. Please let me know. And if you'd like to read more about it, please read the link in the description. If you'd like to see more news headlines like this, subscribe to my channel. Have a great day.